It's Saturday night, and I'm Pastor Rick Jones. The greatest calls to holiness in the New Testament are found in the prayers of the New Testament. The Apostle Paul prayed for the Christians at Ephesus, and he tells of his prayer in the third chapter of his letter to the church. He says, For this cause I bow my knees unto the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ, that he would grant you, according to the riches of his glory, to be strengthened with might by his spirit in the inner man. That Christ may dwell in your hearts by faith, that ye being rooted and grounded in love may be able to comprehend with all saints the breadth, the length, the depth, and the height, and to know the love of Christ that passes knowledge. That you might be filled with all the fullness of God. And it's as if he anticipates that people would doubt that such a prayer could ever be answered. And he concludes, Now unto him who is able to do exceeding abundantly above all that we ask or think, according to the power that works in us, unto him be glory in the church by Christ Jesus throughout all ages, world without end. Amen. Well, this evening we're praying that we might be filled with that kind of love, all the fullness of God. Make it your prayer this evening. Oh, come and dwell in me.
disobey. Lord, give us pure hearts, clean hearts, that we might face you without fear in holiness and love. In Christ's name we pray. Amen.